and welcome back to the channel. On this video, I want to talk about e-bikes and their speed, legal speed that is, and depending on what state you're in, I'm talking USA on this video, and depending on what state you're in, you're going to either be a class 2 speed uh, or class 3 for legal uh, e-bike speeds and class 2 of course is 20 miles per hour whereas class 3 is 28 miles per hour and my question is what about making all the states class 3 so that everybody can ride if they want to as fast as a class 3 speed and I'm not sure why some states have class 3 and some only have class 2 but I say let's make it an option for everybody if they want to uh, if they want to go that fast and so what do you think of that yes or no on that one uh, leave a comment in the comments below I I think class 3 is fine and like I say, you don't necessarily have to go that fast, 28 miles per hour, but I think for people that are commuting, might want to go a little faster than 20 miles an hour. And I don't really see a problem with that. The only place I think that you should not be able to ride that kind of speed would be on bike paths. I think the legal speed should be more like more like 12 to 15 miles an hour because with other people sharing the path with you and, and uh, pedestrians walking and I, I really think that even 20 miles an hour is pretty fast for that but so uh, let me know in the uh, comments what you think of making uh, class three right across the board for every state are you for yes or against no that and let me know your reasons why uh, particularly if you're uh, against it like what is the reason why you would not want that because like i say some states and i'm going to use california as an example they're allowed to go legally 28 miles an hour i think that'd be a good speed i don't think we really need to go faster than approximately 28 miles an hour i think that's a good speed And like I say, if you have a different uh, point of view, let me know in the comments. But like I say, in the uh, pedestrian paths, like in a park or something, there's no way you should be going 28 miles an hour. Even 20 miles an hour is pretty quick. The only, the only time you should be able to go 20 miles an hour would be if there's nobody around at all. You know, it's a big, long path that 
there's nobody around but any of the ones that I've been on there's just no way you can get up to that kind of speed anyway there's turns and people coming toward you and uh, you know dogs on leashes and pushing strollers uh, folks pushing strollers there's just no way it's, it's too dangerous for that but I think on the road as long as you're not being crazy you know and just going about your business riding along I, I don't see a reason why we can't be 28 miles per hour and like I say you don't really if you don't want to you don't have to go 28 miles an hour I'm just saying for the folks that would like to go a little faster Nice to get a ride in today with some sunshine. It was raining earlier, but uh, got a little break right now. And I'm not complaining. Well, that's going to do it for this video on the channel. If you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. And if you'd like to subscribe to the channel, hit that subscribe button and you're, you're in. Once again, if you'd like to leave a comment on this topic, or any other video, this one particularly uh, regarding uh, making uh, class three uh, right across the board in every state. What do you think of that? So once again, thank you for joining me on this video. And until next time, take care.